Hi, this is my trusty assistant. Hello. And we're here to show you and tell you how to make a wind farm. Tire style. Why have a worm farm? Do you guys not home? Well, I do. Worm farms are good for helping mother nature to recycle things. The materials you'll need for making your tire worm farm are four bricks. You'll need an ice cream container, a vivid, a piece of wood, some three to four, two to four tires but we're using three. Um, you'll need some newspaper, some soil, a bucket, and a drill. Step one, get your four bricks, place them in a square position, about the same size as the wood, and then get your piece of wood, and place it on top. Step two, take your vivid and your ice cream container and draw around it. Step three, pick up your drill and draw four to eight holes in the piece of wood. Pick up your ice cream container and get it under so it's about even with the with the um with the vivid line. Step four: get some newspaper and do little wrap then. Keep on doing that until it looks like a hair extension. When you have ripped up your paper, put it into the bucket of water. Then get two handfuls of dirt and put it into the bucket. And then start mixing it up. Then, eat one of your tyres and start and get a handful and squeeze the water out and put it into the bucket. But make sure it's not too firmly stuck in because you need the worms to be able to wriggle around. Step your tyres one on top of the other, like this, then you'll need to keep on stuffing them and when they're all stuffed they should look like this. Take some of the already ripped up newspaper and make it into a little mess. Like he's doing. And then drop it into the bottom of the um of your worm farm. Put two handfuls of dirt into your worm farm. Scatter it around a bit. And then, and then you need to put your worms in. Tiger worms are the best. The last step in your worm farm is to put your lid on. Okay. The worms will eat most food scraps but don't give them citrus foods or meat scraps. And that's how you make a worm farm. Tire style!